The Pepe price is looking really nice uh, long term right now. So we are following a nice bullish trend line to the north. You guys can see it on the price graph right here. And what I want to do in today's video, guys, is give you guys the latest news, the latest price updates for Pepe as we are seeing our big predictions flow through for a bullish outbreak for this crypto. So we're going to take a look at some fundamentals. How are we actually tracking right now? What has been the big news that has dropped for Pepe? So if you guys enjoy the Pepe updates, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification notification bell so you get more retweet follow really appreciate that and also if you do want to get your hands on some free pepe currently in the crypto market you can do so by going to go check out coin w so simply by just trading on coin w right now you can get up to 350 million uh, pepe and one day that might be worth a lot and lots of money so they have lots of options even just depositing 50 dollars can get you between you know 40,000 to 400,000 plus pepe tokens right now and that is going to be looking real real nice but that's going to be the first link in the description of this video special bonus just for followers of my channel right there so make the most of that time limited before it runs out and guys having said that the trend for pepe still looking very very nice uh over the long term so ever since we've kind of had this big breakout from february 2024 we're trending really really nice right now and uh you know what else is interesting is we have started to get a resurgence of bullish momentum coming in into Bitcoin, the bigger caps, Ethereum, and it's looking nice. So Bitcoin has pushed back up above $100,000. So we've having the second $100,000 birthday party for Bitcoin. And uh, it's going to be funny if it keeps dropping below then going back above. So we can keep uh, celebrating $100,000 Bitcoin. But at the moment, $100,000 Bitcoin, this is good. Uh, it's kind of sticking to this zone, but it's a nice zone to stick to. Honestly, $100,000 Bitcoin. I could, uh, I really like the that number, to be honest. Uh, Ethereum is also going to be something that might send Pepe really, really high. Uh, coming up in the future so you have to remember you know behind Pepe Ethereum is going to be the trading pair on mini DEXs out there and it is running on the Ethereum chain as well and you have a look at the long-term uh, price movements of this so I have right here Binance Ethereum tether pair and we are getting super close to breaking the all-time high for Ethereum so at the moment guys we're looking at around 4,000 Ethereum all-time high for Ethereum is going to be around 4,800 so wow we are potentially going to get there and uh, that is looking good so have a look at that trend line as well so if you enter your technical analysis check out that trend to the north and uh, the reason is trending to the north uh, to be completely honest with you guys is there is just a huge amount of institutional money uh, coming into the crypto market so there is just a huge wave of giga money coming into bitcoin ethereum and what we want to see is we do also want to see you know a pepe etf meme coin etf come up in the future we have heard you know van eck talk about it and uh, we want to see this become more mainstream in the future so i do think a uh, more etfs for pepe definitely could be a game-changing catalyst for this cryptocurrency as this crypto market starts to mature so again you know cryptos like pepe they started off as uh you know jokes or all the way back down here so you guys know we checked out pepe all the way down here 30 million dollars in market cap right here but the truth is you know the bigger the market cap the less of the joke this is because people are walking away with huge amounts of money and i still think right now pepe has a lot of potential to go so if we have a look right here people are predicting a big breakout for uh, pepe right here so they're talking about a price surge to around the three level okay so if we if we break out to the three level right here so we're talking about going long in the crypto market at this zone um we definitely could be into again this will be all-time high territory for pepe so we have a look at this price graph right here we're in the two zones so we're basically consolidating around the twos if we were to even to you know potentially retrace and then go up to the threes guys that's going to be an all-time high territory for pepe right there so once we break into this three zone uh, all-time high so that's basically what a one and a half x from where we are right now and you know what's exciting about that that is going to be the stuff that moves the pepe market cap uh into you know competitive regions against ship so we have been speaking about ship as a big competitor to pepe and if we have a look at the ship price right now you can see 18 billion dollars in market cap so the more you know we can get these big gains flowing into pepe that's a breakout zone we would love to see but of course you know if we have to trade sideways i'm going to be staying patient in the crypto market for that and we do know look in terms of other catalysts coming up for pepe you know the community is getting very very strong over on x 
There is a Reddit cryptocurrency community growing. We're seeing big exchanges tweet about Pepe. Elon Musk has been tweeting about Pepe. And, uh, you know, there is talk about a big 25th of December buy-in for Pepe. So if the Pepe army does coordinate, that does happen. People do buy into this crypto on the 25th of December. That's going to be a huge, huge, uh, you know, price increase for Pepe if that does happen. And having said that, guys, let's talk about long-term Pepe price. Because we know at the moment, guys, Pepe is a big boy, but he, he still can get bigger. So I still think you know, there's potential for Pepe to ride to 50 $50 billion in market cap. I think there's potential for Pepe to go to $100 billion in market cap. You know, that's going to be some really, really nice gains over the long term. 2025, remember, this is going to be the biggest year, I think, personally, for crypto. So, you know, what's kind of annoying right now is, you know, people, they're going to see, I reckon the crypto prices are just going to continuously creep up in terms of price. So, slowly but surely, this stuff will just creep. So, I'm thinking, you know, it just creeps all the way up to like $150,000. ETH, you know, creeps up to like 6,000 and then 10,000. XRP, look, XRP is back on the surge today. And this is what can happen with Pepe. So it can just do this kind of slow creep. And before we know it, we might be looking at like, you know, $20 billion Pepe, uh, and then it might be 50 billion before we know it. And then it might be like $150,000 Bitcoin, $200,000 Bitcoin, and uh, with all this institutional money coming in. So you always have to remember, you know, you know the big comparison for crypto is a lot of the time it's benchmarked against the gold market cap, especially Bitcoin, gold market cap about 15 to 20 trillion. Um, so if we get that just over time as institutional money switches from investing into gold to investing into Bitcoin, this is the stuff where it could get very, very, very exciting. So just keep that on the radar uh, long term right there. And I still think Pepe has plenty and plenty of potential to go. And guys, that is a huge update. I'm staying bullish long term on Pepe right now. If you guys are as well, subscribe, follow. And also, if you want to get yourself some free Pepe, make sure to go check out CoinW. $50 worth the deposit, hold it for 48 hours. You're going to walk away with like 40 to 400,000 Pepe tokens. And one day, that might be worth a lot of money. And that is a special bonus just for you guys on the channel. But really appreciate you tuning in. Go have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Crypto Zeus signing out.